This is the MA Fine Art program. We are part of School of Art and Design at Prague City University. Uh, we are a highly international program as the school itself. It's a, a program of two years of law residency, uh, meaning that students have uh, a time to work and study as well. Uh, what is important for prospective students is the curiosity and I would say stamina to work uh, consistently on a project over a longer period of time uh, to not be bound by the media but more by a kind of a dynamic between research and practice. The program attracts students from across art and design and it is best uh, suited for uh, students who already have uh, experience and strong practice coming from a BA in art, uh, preferably, but also design, uh, and are prepared to, on the one hand, challenge and also further develop their media and uh, their practice, but also learn to work uh, very much with research and with the dynamic between uh, a strongly theoretical kind of research side of the program and highly practical studio-based uh, daily sort of practice in the, uh, in the, within the studios here at Pragovka where we are filming now. Fine Art and Future Design MAs are both low residency programs and uh, this means that working artists and professionals can join. The teaching happens usually in the afternoons uh, and there is a lot of uh, self-reliance as in any MA program uh, so that the students have studio access 24-7 so they are free to use their studio whenever and as much as they need but the teaching itself is uh, focus to the afternoons, late afternoons and the early evenings in order to allow students to also work during their MA. Especially in the first year, uh, where the two semesters are equally divided between theoretical subjects and the practical work in the studio, supported by workshops and by uh, teachers who are continually working with our students inside the studio. This relationship between practice and theory continues into the second year uh, where the work is uh, far more focused, it becomes more um, organized more around students' major projects that continue until the final exhibition at the end of the program. And uh, at this point, each student becomes paired up with a mentor. Uh, mentors are either colleagues who work at the university or sometimes uh, artists, uh, local artists or international artists. Advanced practice is a new feature of the program. Uh, it is either a residency or a research project or internship that students undertake uh, between their first and second year of study. It is meant to support their professional outlook, focus them, teach them to communicate with the outside world and gain some experience while studying. The logic of the program follows the idea that we are really building a major project over a long period of time. So sometimes students may change completely what they do, but what doesn't change is the relationship between research and practice, the focus on process uh, over product, the focus on context, uh, the idea that they are gradually building a certain practice that they can commit to over a longer period of time. But the results are actually always surprising to us, to students sometimes as well, they come as a result of a very long period of uh, thinking, of trying things out in the studio, of showing smaller portions of work publicly, sometimes testing ideas in different media, not the medium that the student is most, uh, com like most uh, familiar with. Throughout the program, students get a chance to show their work publicly, in school and outside of school, in small group exhibitions, site-specific projects and small showcases that they organize in the second year and that prepare them for the final exhibition, which is the major public event that students are fully in charge of and it happen at the end of the program. Both our students and our teachers come from a 
really wide variety of specialisms. We have had students graduate with projects that focus on bio art, on coding, on video, on sculpture, on painting. And it is interesting to see that considering the variety and range of different specialisms, how focused and how intense the dialogue and collaboration can be both within the studio and in the theoretical classes.